I'm uh, Demon Wolf, and I'm Demon Wolf, and welcome back to Let's Play Spooked In Four. There's Bartholomew. I've taken the liberty of settling here. Okay. Hmm. You wish to speak with me? Now he'll make like very good stuff like this. And a corn. And a corn. Horn. Uh, don't have any pearl shells. And I think they're better equipment for Ned. Nope, I think you had to be a woman to equip them, but... Whatever. I say equip best, but no. I'm lying. I should give him a speed, but... The increase of accuracy is amazingly good for him. I wish I could give him, like, better equipment. Then again, look at my attack, look at my defense. Quite good, pretty even. Almost. This is also quite cool. Look at that attack. It's over 400. Now then, we'll go into the room we have not been in yet at all. The accessory atelier, or whatever you call it. Anyway, we got all them. Mr. Dumbo, make yourself at home. Alright, lucky ring, okay, cape. Oh, was that a power ring? Increases strength. Dragon's bone. I can go down and fight that land dragon as many times as I want, so I might go back and do that. It's a power ring, increases strength, that's not bad. Don't really need it though. Pearl necklace. Increases magic defense. Nullify magic once per battle. Ah, that's not bad. Increases strength and fire resistance. Sure. Uh. Yeah, two's fine. See, I got lucky rings equipped right now, but I'll change those soon. Let's get the rose crest. How much strength does that increase by? Mm, not a whole lot. Increase physically attack. Does it attack power? I'll give you that instead of the strength sash. But I'll give you the strength sash. Those flame amulets will come in handy. Not for this team, but the next team I have. I think she does the same thing. I think they all do the same thing. Yeah. What's these first ones? Earth magic, counter, yeah. Hey, nice of you join us. Please take your time looking around. Anyway. Neat. So that's not bad. Flame amulets I've got. Uh, what are you doing? Oh, training at Mr. Reynolds' place. That reminds me, I should train at this place, but I'm not going to because... I still... Oh, no, I don't. I'll train. Now shall we train? Alright, let's do it. That's what I want to hear. Now watch how easy I destroy them. Also, I love my weapon. It's black. <laughs> oh, you attacked me! How dare thee! <laughs> now you die. I want to see if they give me an experience for beating the final group. So, I'm gonna do it like this. Because me and Carl can take out any enemy by herself, and then I would use Snow and Ted to take out the other guy. Alright. Doesn't really help if they, uh,. Dodge me, though. What are you doing? Ah, you're being a nick. In that case, I'll just do this. I'm fully healed for the next fight now. As experience was that. Well, not bad. At least I'm getting experience. I'm not getting any at no bell runes anymore. 
All right, fourth fight. I'll use the combo soon, but not yet. Ain't that awesome? Okay, I'm actually getting experience. I'm actually do this for a bit until they're level 60. Alright, now let's see if any of us level up after this fight. First of all, combo him. You just kill him and you kill him. Yeah, they barely do any damage to us. Well, I say yes, but my character Snow and Carl take extra damage because of, well, the rune they have equipped. Double strike rune. We do more damage, but we take more in the process. Oh, actually, that was actually quite good. We actually leveled up from that. Almost twice. See you soon. Well, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna do that fight a couple of times until we're like level 60. See you soon. All right, I'm back. I came up to the ship, and look what I found. There's a statue of me. All he needs is some color in it, and it'll really be me. Where's this guy? Delighted. All right. Hiya, bite. Looks like there's one song I haven't heard. Huh? Yep. That was amazing. He waved his hand once and that entire tune came out. You're amazing, my friend. Alright. I'm looking for someone. There you are. Yo, you wanna play a match with me? You're wrong. Let's play. <coughs> Let's play. Right. It's technically like Beyblade. You want to be a, as close to the red marker as possible. That's a bad one. Must be so good at this. Oh yeah, I win, man. <coughs> oh, I lost. There we go. Next match. Turn your controller as fast as you can and get the next one in. And I win again. That's pretty much what you do. Um, you get 20 straight wins, you get a treasure map, but I don't really care for that. <coughs> oh, that's a good one. That one's not going down. I'm out. And I've lost this one. Goodbye, cruel world. I will see you in the next universe. So this is what this is. Just over and over again. It's kind of like Beyblade, but not as cool. Ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, uh. Didn't get a good critical on that one. Damn it. Yeah, I've lost. Anyway. I like how the music is from Rayman, it's like when you lose. I'm not playing your stupid game. Hey, play with me! No. No more mini games. Now. I think we'll go to the war room now. Because I'm pretty much ready for the final part of the game. Let's see. I don't know what that beeping noise is, but whatever. The time has finally come. Now here's a simple explanation of our strategy. Uh, can you keep it brief, please? I have trouble remembering long-winded things. I just got done saying it would be simple. You do remember that, don't you? 
Right. Uh, sorry, sorry. Uh, go on. I'll give you detailed instructions when the time comes. But first, about the rune cannon. Show it to me one more time. Fort El Eel is at the southern end of Kuluk. It also serves as a window to commerce and diplomacy. It's called a fort, but it's more like a large castle. Sorry about that. It's called a fort, but it's more like a large castle. The rune cannon is at the top of the building. If we don't destroy it, we won't be able to get close. So first, we'll send in a detachment to get rid of it. At the same time, our main force will remain in front and attack Kuluk's first fleet. This fleet usually roams the area near the harbor in case the rune cannon cannot be fired. There are times when the rune cannon cannot be fired? Once it's been fired, that particular rune cannon takes time to reload. It was written in the letter from Mr. Amada. We'll have to trust that information. This downtime will be the perfect opportunity for us to strike. I see. So we're going to make them fire the rune cannon once, then destroy it before they can fire another round. Well, that's pretty much it. Have I made myself clear? Want to hear it again? Okay. Shall we go with this plan? I'd like to execute this in the morning, three days from now. Everyone, please use this time to get ready. I'd like you to decide on members for the detachment. Come talk to me whenever it's convenient. So you are going after all, even though you finally regained your kingdom? Yes. If we leave everything as is, we're bound to suffer the same consequences. Even you know that, don't you, Setsu? Yes, sir. Sorry for eating chocolate. All right, everybody, listen up. Once we hit El Il, the threat to the islands should disappear for a while. It may only be temporary, though. But remember, we're fighting for lasting peace. That's exactly what's most important to all of us now, right? Oh, crap. Right. And that's why I chose to put my life on the line. All right, lasts us tomorrow. Mm. A terrifying game. Would you like to select members for the attachment team? Yes, I'm ready. Okay then. Decide which members you want. They'll be separated from the main force for a while, so the ones you choose must be able to hold their own. By the way, you can't go. You must stay here and command the forces. All the ones assigned to the ship are left. Alright, I'll do basic party first. This is gonna be... No. Carl. Um... Ted. With the support of um, no one. All right, the separate task force. First member is Jeremy. 
and I can find him. Jeremy. Gene. Warlock. And where you be, my friendy? Tristan. Okay, go with them. Oh, the Gary. Ship party one. Lino. Tal. Axel. Aldo. Ship party two. Right back. Just doing high level. Pika. Gao. Sorry. Someone in here stronger than Kika right now. <coughs> yeah, meets with a. There we go. Okay, then. I will accompany the detachment and instruct them directly. Look, uh, Lady Eleanor! Wait a minute. Won't it be dangerous for the tactician to accompany them? We must destroy the rune cannon by any means necessary. That's why I'm going. I've got the map of the fort and the structure of the rune cannon memorized in my head already. I'm counting on you, Miss Eleanor. If that's what you think, I have no right to stop you guys. But please be careful. Only time for the shoe time. We better put a lot of spirit into this. Mr. Demon Wolf, please, please take care of his majesty. It's about the ship. Please go into my room later. It's time. It's finally time, isn't it? Morgan. Bang. Well, I guess I could go and try and get the Pyre King boots, but... Ah, oh, you can be yours. <laughs> so in that case, I'll take that. There we go. I think we're supposed to rest here. Or we're supposed to sail there, I'm not sure. Got them chocolate. There we go. She's not here! Oh no! Do have the shield there, or uh, what? I run down the stairs, but that was lazy. Oh, so I am ready. Yes, we did have to sleep. Okay. The decisive battle will take place tomorrow morning. I'm counting on you.
victory will be ours. You know what's kind of funny? And uh, speaking of tactics, the hero character appears in the game at the start, and he actually has a voice. Not again, I don't know why he has no voice in Sweden 4. Unless Sweden and Tactics came after 4. Did that make more sense? Tomorrow's our big moment, isn't it? If we survive tomorrow. Don't worry, we'll be able to return to Razoril. That's right. Let's do our best tomorrow. I wonder what I'll do when I finally get back to Razoril. Well. I don't see snow. Yeah, Carl's over his training. The dog's scratching my window right now. Hey, guys. what are you doing here? We've got to get an early start tomorrow. I was wondering, that rune of yours, is it a great burden? You know, Brando died alone. But that was his choice. He never let anyone, not even his friends, get close to him. It's pitiful to think about, actually. Did Brando say anything? No, never mind. Uh, I'm sorry, forget what I said. Dog scratching at my window. <laughs> oh, he hears my voice and wants attention. I got my attention after a day. Let's do our best, dude, Sir Demon Wolf. All that train I labored three must have been for this final battle. So, you're not going back to Middleport or the Rheinbach family fleet after this fight is over? <laughs> what kind of question is that? No, I'm just asking. Well, I've already severed my ties to that place. In the eyes of Middleport, I'm a dead man. I intend to stay in the pirate business. I'll spend my whole life repaying Lady Kika for taking me in. What about you? Aren't you going to find your calling? I don't think so. I too would rather stay as Lady Kika's right-hand man. Well, first, we have to get tomorrow over and done with. Oh, right. Yeah. Right indeed. Righty dighty dighty. And diddly diddly dee. And all the um, smiting the waddle dees. I don't know what I'm saying. Hey, we're about to go into the final battle. We should talk to everyone. As my. <laughs> Got a hair in my mouth there. What are you doing up here? Please advance my father. Never mind, Dad. You can stay up here. Uh oh, oh boy. I'm starting to get a little nervous. No, funny enough, I read a description on him. Apparently, he does not bathe for months on end. Hmm, weird. Well, then again, this is set in the pirate era. Is it pirate era? Blah. This is set like in. Well, not really pirate era. It's like pirates, boats, what stuff. Oh, whatever. I will give it everything I've got. I'll do my best and survive this. What are you doing? We're going, not going to lose. Let's make sure to win. Like, I don't know about you. This seems like the most impractical use of how to move a ship. Because he has to literally turn them like that. Like your dude you saw at the start when he first did it. That just seems a nightmare. So it's finally the decision. 
The price of bottle. No need to worry though, this ship's not This ship's got the great jangle on its side. Why can't I get in there? So it's finally time. Soon our fight will be over. Do my best, I'll be fine. We step all night. Keep in watch. I'm not gonna talk to everyone, it'll take forever. Let me go to the I think we'll go here. Answer gutsing, yeah. <sighs> Can't fall asleep. Maybe a drink will do the trick. What kind of example are you setting, Lady Eleanor? We should go to sleep so we'll be ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow. I wonder if I'll see Cray tomorrow. Long ago, he used to be my subordinate. A tactician and an assistant in the service of the Scarlet Moon Empire. But out of the blue, he attacked the nobles of Scarlet Moon. How many years has it been since then? Three hundred million. <sighs> I don't know how old she is. Kind of old, though. I had no idea. Back then, something definitely happened to Cray. He suddenly exchanged his left hand with a steel one. Even worse, Cray used his son as a pawn and let him die. Oh, wow. I'm positive that something triggered his rebellion. But no matter how much I questioned him, he never answered. In the end, he was expelled and I was discharged. He was a good kid, too. But now... I regret my being unable to save him. Lady Eleanor, would you like some more? Ah. Oh. Raise a deck, he killed his own son? What's wrong? You can't sleep, huh? In that case, let me tell you a little story. Oh, great. The rune you now hold? It was summoned from the ruins of the kingdom 15 years ago by the Queen of Obel. She was my wife. We lived normal lives, resisting the rune's lure. Then one day, we were attacked by pirates. Our kids were on the ship, too. Flair and her younger brother, they were just newborns. My lady died, saving them. She defeated the pirates, but our ship sustained heavy damage. My youngest went missing. If he were alive, he would be about your age now. Just a couple more years, and I might have shared a drink with him. Oh, but make no mistake. I haven't supported you in an attempt to replace my lost son. It's not that at all. <laughs> okay, okay. I'm going to sleep now. You should, too. Be ready for tomorrow. <clears throat> when I first heard that story, I was thinking, could my character be his kid? But I don't know if it's true or not. It could be, or for all I know, there could be a character on this ship that's actually his son, his long lost son. Or it could be me. I don't know. So if anyone watches this video and knows the answer, I would really like to know in the comments, because I can't be arsed searching it up. I could search it up, I just can't be arsed. Well, it's finally time, isn't it? What's your back here? My strength is yours to wield. Use it as you see fit. <sighs> Although it may not be very much. Just wanted to let you know that. Well, good night.
knights, no? And good luck. Oh, it's a ship make noise. Okay. I thought he was hungry, like, incredibly hungry. And there's Crazy Woman. The trial of the rune will end. The time for atonement shall pass. The time for forgiveness shall begin. That is your destiny. And the destinies of the hundred and eight who have gathered around you. Thanks for the info. I don't remember this. I really don't remember this. What's going on? Why am I glowing? I think the your hero's name's like actually supposed to be called Lando or something. Is my party there? No, it is not. How dare they? They stole my party. You're weird. Noble portrait. Ah, so pretty. Noble portrait. Ah, so pretty. Leave that there. Yeah, I like the pot of Roswell. Right, uh... I think we'll go to the war room now. Yep, whatever. Nope. Alright, I'll see you next video.